Uh, Faith Series 1 was happy, carefree. Series 3, you've got a resilient, tougher fighter. Faith wakes up on a Wednesday morning with her husband with a hangover. He leaves for work and uh, never comes back. And she lands herself in very dark, murky, frightening waters that she's not used to. But look, my husband, that's what I need. I need my husband. And quickly we see somebody's life falling apart. She gets introduced to some very, very cruel and dangerous characters, which puts her life and her children's life in danger. We're led to believe halfway through the series that he has been killed. And lo and behold, when we think all things have been tied up at the end, she somehow keeps her head above water and he turns up. And that's the end of series one. 18 months later, and her and Evan are trying and failing to be together. There's too much happened, there's too much deceit. We see her literally and physically fighting back, trying to gain control and the biggest downfall is that she cannot forgive and she cannot let go. I mean, what is that? Is that one or two or three or four or five betrayals? I mean, I've seriously started to lose count. So I approached her as like, she's like a swan in series two. What you see on the outside is something quite elegant and goes about her business and runs that company and is, is really good with her kids and she becomes almost like a wonder woman in it. But underneath she's kicking and fighting and struggling like crazy. But we only share that with you, the audience. But Gail Reardon really kind of um, starts to take the reins in series two and starts to control Faith's life emotionally and physically, professionally. And we find Faith starting to fall into the trap that Evan possibly fell into before season one. Whereas she does one favour, and that snowballs into something much, much bigger, and then all of a sudden they own your life, and they will destroy you. But she's not a coward, and she's mentally stronger than Evan, so she fights back. It's time for you to go. And that's where you find Faith Howells in series two. And then series three, we have somebody who is yet to forgive and somebody who we as an audience are yet to know. We know everybody else in the series, but until series three, we don't really know who Faith is, but you'll find out in this series.